Tesla apparently are just about to show the Model 3 Highland in China. And this actually makes a lot of sense when you look at what they just did on the website, the US website, changes to Model 3 prices, even changes to Model Y prices within the last 24 hours. Very interesting times at the moment. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. Great to see you. My name is Sam Evans. Thank you for tuning in. And this is kind of an interesting point. Elon Musk obviously is in China right now, hasn't been there for years. Amazing. I thought he would have been, but he hasn't. So he's there right now in China. Word is he's about to show the Model 3 Highland. And now if you look on Tesla's website, you can see some changes to Model 3 and even Model Y pricing. So this has all happened within the last 24 hours, the last 12 to 24 hours, actually. Tesla apparently are planning to show off the Model Y, the Model 3, I should say, the Highland version imminently. Now, interestingly, Tesla Rati have just reported that they say they've found filing showing that last summer, Tesla were working already on the Highland. So this project has been going on for quite a long time, longer than what people have realized. So now after about a year of working on the car, or at least having filings about the car, Tesla are planning to show off the vehicle within a matter of hours in China. So at the same time as this is happening, Tesla is going to reduce prices on their website again for the Model 3, particularly just of inventory stock. A lot of stock is not reduced, but inventory stock in particular is reduced. So if you want to get a really good price right now, could be the time to jump in. I think the new model will be more expensive. Citing people familiar with the matter, apparently people who know what's going on with the Highland, they say the new version of the sedan is slightly longer and sportier than the current version. I'm not sure how it could be longer. That's interesting. I mean, if it is, then that means there's bigger changes coming than what we all thought. I don't think anyone thought the vehicle would be any different in terms of dimensions. I mean, we thought there'd be a redesigned bumper, but that wouldn't really change the dimensions. Maybe, maybe by a few millimeters, but not actually making it slightly longer. So being sportier, I wonder what that means by being sportier. Maybe that just means it looks sportier. What do you guys reckon? Let me know in the comments. I mean, I'm really interested to know what you think here. Tesla, of course, will roll out some other features as well. Hardware for new cameras, some changes to the interior, obviously redesigns on the exterior. There's some other changes going on as well. I think new batteries are coming. When? Maybe now, maybe later, but they are coming at some point. China is actually an incredibly important market for Tesla. And I think that's probably part of the reason why Elon Musk is back over there now. He's trying to negotiate for a new factory, a second factory to build more Tesla vehicles, not just the mega factory for batteries that they're breaking ground on within a few months, but Tesla have been applying and been getting knocked back apparently to build a second factory right next to the Gigafactory in Shanghai. So I think Elon Musk is there trying to negotiate on getting that through, getting that happening. So what about these discounts on Tesla's cars? Well, Tesla have doubled discounts on some already made new Model 3 electric cars, and they've offered discounts on Model Y and others in its US inventory to entice buyers. In California, Model 3 variants in inventory are priced at $42,000 US dollars. That's the long range version, by the way. So that's a discount of $2,700 US dollars on the price of newly ordered cars, according to the website. And that's double the $1,300 discount that Tesla has been offering on Model 3 cars over the last few weeks. So some models, if you get in now, you check quickly, you can get a pretty big discount now. In addition to that, Tesla resumed discounts on some Model Ys of around $600 each. So if you jump on the Tesla website, put in your state, see if that's relevant to you, it may be. Tesla offered steeper discounts of $6,330 and $5,000 US dollars on some higher priced Model X and Model S vehicles as well. So, I mean, if you've been looking at one of those, could be a good time now with those bigger discounts. In other news, Tesla stock, it just jumped above 200 US dollars. The market seems to like what's going on with Tesla. I think there's a bit of excitement about the new models, a bit of excitement this year about maybe, you know, Elon Musk getting back there, getting back into Tesla, being rejuvenated, being excited for the future of Tesla. Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. Guys, thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.